Have you ever heard a great story? Today we are going to learn about how the Lord Jesus Christ used stories about everyday situations to illustrate great Bible truths. When Jesus lived on this earth over 2,000 years ago, he performed amazing miracles, preached powerful messages, and taught transforming lessons to the people around him. One way Jesus taught was in parables. A parable is a story given by the Lord Jesus Christ with one great truth or lesson for us to learn. As we learn more about the parables by Christ, we will see that these are the greatest stories ever told. Why should we learn about the parables of Jesus? Nearly one-third of the recorded teachings of Jesus Christ are given to us in parables. We must understand the parables of Christ to understand the teaching of Christ. But you may think, but I'm just a child. How can Christ's parables help me? We know that they can help you because they are the Word of God. In 2 Timothy chapter 3, verse 15 and 16, the Bible says, And that from a child thou hast known the holy scriptures, which are able to make thee wise unto salvation, through faith which is in Christ Jesus. All scripture is given by inspiration of God, and is profitable for doctrine, for reproof, for correction, for instruction in righteousness. Let's memorize the 13 most famous parables and where they are found in Scripture. Once you memorize these titles and passages, you can read each of these parables for yourself in your Bible. The 13 parables are found in Matthew chapter 7, the hearers and doers. The sower, which is found in Matthew chapter 13, the wheat and the tares, also found in Matthew chapter 13, a grain of mustard seed, Matthew chapter 13, Leaven hid in meal, chapter 13 of Matthew. A hidden treasure, Matthew chapter 13. One pearl of great price, found in Matthew 13. And a net cast into the sea, also found in Matthew chapter 13. In Matthew chapter 18, we see the unforgiving servant. In Matthew chapter 20, laborers in the vineyard. We see the two sons called to work in Matthew chapter 21. And the wicked husbandmen, also found in Matthew chapter 21 and the marriage of the king's son, found in Matthew chapter 22. Before you read these parables, pray and ask God to help you to be an obedient hearer and doer of the truths he will show you. All of Christ's parables can be found in the first three gospel records, which are Matthew, Mark, and Luke. We are praying that as you read these greatest stories ever told, the Lord would speak to your heart. Thanks for learning with us. 